Okay, this is why I love the internet. Because people love to tell their stories. And I love that the moron that posted this can you spell millionaire, right? Freaking imbecile. All right, ready, roll them. In business, right? But you, you got enough of a taste that it, it validated yeah. for you that it was yes. real. You knew that there was an option. And you kept investing in courses. This is the part that blows my mind. I mean, I, I did the same thing, but it blows, most people just don't do this. You kept investing in what wasn't working. Why? I don't know. I just, you know, because I think I was just an idiot, really. <laughs> no, I, no, no. Why, well, really? Why did you stick with it? Because most people give up when it doesn't work the first time. And you didn't work, but you found what did work, right? You right. said, well, I'm not making money, but I did do this. I did learn that. What made you keep going? Why did you have to keep pushing through till you finally succeeded? Well, a few things. One, any progress at all, I knew. Like, if I got no response from it all, I would have abandoned at least that idea, that concept. But since some response came, even though it wasn't profitable, I just had the mindset of, I just need to improve enough to make it profitable. Just make and, it better. Yeah, just, just to get it to work better. Got it. Because it was working, you know, in, in essence, kind you of. You never called it failure for you. It was just, this isn't good enough, and I'll make it better, and I'll make it better, and I'll make it right. better. So you kept having those iterations until you hit, until you, until you made it happen. But in the meantime, you accumulated on your credit cards $100,000. Yeah, How much debt did you accumulate? Well, eventually with, uh, well, let's back up for a minute. Because okay. most people think, oh, $100,000 credit card debt. Well, how could you have, um, you know, that kind of credit card debt, you know, being like in your early 20s? And yeah. uh, I'd like to tell the story real quick because Please, I think I it's, uh, I'm sure it's, been it's, on it's, it's one of my most, I say this jokingly, one of my most amazing life accomplishments. So when I was in college, I'll give you the, just the short version of this, uh, roommate comes back in, opening his mail, and he's like, you know, he had a Visa card, and he was all excited about it. I just got this credit card with a $500 limit or, you know, whatever it was. And I was like, oh, well, how'd you get that? I'm like, you know, you don't even have a job. You just you're in, just came to school like me, and he's like, oh, he's like, anyone can get a credit card. <laughs> and I was like, really? He's like, yeah. He's like, go to the student union. You'll see brochures for all these credit cards. And everyone I know is like, they'll just give you a credit card. I'm like, oh, I'm like, well, can you get more than one? He's like, no. He's like, I tried, you know, and, and they rejected me saying I already had, you know, credit and that it was too much of a risk or whatever else. And I was like, oh, that's too bad. Well, about an hour passed, a little light bulb went off in my evil scheming head. And I was like... <laughs> Well, what if I just sent in all the applications on the same day where I didn't have any credit yet? How would they know who's about to give me oh credit? My God. So I, you know, in hindsight, it was kind of, you know, reckless. Yes. But um, but you were looking for. But capital I may not be where I am business. today if I didn't have that access to capital. So yeah. I sent them all in on the same day. How many? I think it was like 13 or 14. Wow. And I had immediately had access to probably, I think it was about twenty thousand dollars in credit lines. And I was like 18 years old, didn't have a job, nothing. And we wonder why we have <laughs> the financial debacle yeah, we so, did, so right? I'm not, I'm not proud of that, but it is part of the but process. But it gave you leverage. Right, so I used some of the money. <laughs> that's the, that's the, one of the funniest things I've ever heard. Oh, my God. This is, it's just, it's just a beautiful world.